Cameron Green's joined up with the squad. Uh, mentioned about Ben Stokes, he offers such so much to the team, and he's coming off, um, you know, a great series in India for us, and then obviously on the back of a very successful IPL. So he, he brings so much to the table, and it's great that he's got some confidence. Hopefully, he gets a little bit of a rest before he can get back into it. Um, but he's he's a huge part of the side. I think we just sort of have to look through it in different lens. That any cricket is preparation now, and obviously he's doing work in the background to make sure that his bowling loads are up, that he's actually ready for Test cricket. So I think. Now we, we look at it as if you're involved in high intensity, high class cricket, that's, we're happy with that because being that he brings to the table and how successful uh, he's been in that, that number six position um, and then the question will be around the, the fourth seam all rounder and, and Takor and, and then obviously Ashwin, so pretty good choices. Obviously Ashwin is an incredible bowler um, and he'd be first choice in most teams um, but just with their combination it may lead to that but I think we expect the oval to behave, it always behaves, it's, it's a good wicket but it can offer a lot for spinners as the game goes on. A little bit of acclimatising up north and now we'll be able to get down here, get into it, looks an amazing setup. so I think the guys are pretty excited about getting back into it. It's looking pretty good, I think we're keeping an eye on Josh Hazelwood as has been mentioned, um, just to see how he gets through these next couple of sessions but it feels like everyone's targeting this, this obviously.
Thank you, Bia. Thank you, Bia. made of Virat Kohli at uh, RCB the last couple of years. I mean, what have you learnt from him uh, being a teammate of his at RCB? I think probably how hard he works, um, you know, and his fitness first of all, but probably his, his skill work as well. Um, batting and fielding in particular is, you know, he's always out there, you know, first you know, and leaves last, that sort of stuff. And um, probably just the intensity that he trains at all the time. Um, at such a high level, I think it drags sort of, drags everyone else along for the ride and um, that can sort of, leak onto the other players and, and improve them as well. So yeah, the intensity is one thing that's that's right up there. And Mohamed Siraj as well at RCB. I mean, he's sort of emerging. He's sort of getting better as the last couple of years, isn't he? Yeah, I think in particular this year. Um, I was a bit late to getting there, but before then he was he was on fire um, up there at the top of the wickets every time. But the economy rate was probably the thing that bowling at Chinnaswamy is almost impossible sometimes. And he was going at 6.6 and a half and over. Um, so I think, you know, his control was great. Um, yeah. He